So I'm here with Tim Melnick, who I just bought his awesome prank. Can you hold that up for me, Tim? Sure can. This thing is amazing! I'm super it. excited to get it on my wall. Uh, so, what kind of prints do you make? Uh, these are mine over here, so I love yeah. doing environmental concepts. I like just coming up with like worlds where people can live in, like create things that I've never seen before or I'd like to see if they could exist in the real world. Mm -hmm. Neat. Um, do you have a website? I do. It's uh, on my card here. I don't know if you can zoom in. I have a blog because I can't think of a better name. Blogspot.com. Very nice. Long name, but I don't know. I like. I'll put it in my show stuff. notes as well. Here, I will take one of these real yeah. quick. Sure. Um, so. I have, a, I have a third question, which is difficult, that I just thought of. There's a lot of character art here. I mean, even if we look over here, there's, we got Black Mages and uh, Dragon Ball Z, and it's kind of all over the place, but you're here doing original landscapes and, and images. Mm -hmm. uh, do you find that, that the character art does better, or that... It's actually really hard to say. Like, earlier I did um, Anime Expo in L.A. this summer, mm -hmm. and I think because I was pretty much the only environmental artist, I did extremely well. Like, people came up and then like it's my favorite art in the whole show I guess because it's different than everything uh, I guess you definitely have to compete because some people only go for fan art but there's mm -hmm. a lot of people that appreciate environmental art too so it's a good balance awesome thank you so much for your time and yeah, for the print thank you very much so I am with Caitlin Burns or Kate Burns as she is known in the criminal world like I got one of those there are things behind her falling down and I just bought one of these awesome oh plant things from my studio. So I'm really excited. She's got some brilliant work here. Kate, can you tell us about your work? Uh, sure. I uh, was doing fine art just as fun for my family and friends. And then it started going over really well with them. So I decided, let's try out a small show. Tried out a small show in Kitchener. Went really well. Did Fan Expo. Went really well. And looks like I'm going to be doing it a lot more often. So, in term, in in short, in short, you would say that things are going really well. I would say things are going really well. Not, you know, marginally. Awesome! Thank you so much for this awesome stuff. Thank you for coming. It is five o'clock. Kind of. My camera says it's four, but my camera is lying. And everyone is leaving, and it is time to say goodbye to Fan Expo. I have met lots of cool things, and Joy and Allison have requested not to appear on film, and so they won't. <laughs> I will see you guys next week with a Fan Expo talk about economics. Cause I'd love you even if we were being chased by a horde of zombies. I'd never leave you behind.